geospatial technology has essentially three components. Geographic information science, that's the ability to make computer-based maps. Um, GPS, global positioning systems, which allows us to take hardware out into the field, get our point location, and then transfer that data and be able to make a map with it. And remote sensing, which allows us to look at things from a distance, from a remote situation, and look at changes on the earth over a period of time. Every public land agency uses all three disciplines um, to manage their resources. GIS is a fairly new science. It's in demand by a lot of agencies. So I'm uh, currently working for a water conservation company, and I'm looking for new ways to promote the business. I use geographic information systems at work, so I'm just trying to get more into depth. I really like maps a lot, so it's really interesting to drill down into different features and to look at data. Dealing with the outdoors, the public. Uh, I like the software, the programming, learning something new. And I'd like to help educate the public to take care of our national parks. A lot of times they're regular hours during the week, but if you've got to do field data collection, say with a GPS, you might be out there uh, for longer periods of time out in the field. You need to be very disciplined with yourself. Uh, you need to be passionate about it. You, you want to like what you're doing. Find programs that allow you to get out in the field, that have the instructors within their programs that can, that can share their professional experiences. Get as much experience doing these different classes um, in, in a geospatial program, whether it's GIS or remote sensing or GPS. There's various components to each of those disciplines, and the more you learn, the better. The real estate industry, emergency response, disaster management, utility companies, it's a continuously growing field. And it's a field that's gonna require a lot of people to get involved with in the future because geospatial technology is just becoming more and more prevalent out there in, in the world. A lot of good people in the field. So you do have an opportunity to be out in the field. You do have an opportunity to work with people. You do have an opportunity to be amongst the animals, amongst the land, and see how it changes. It's a unique field. It's a growing field. There isn't an industry or a government agency that's not using some type of geospatial technology.